You all right? What's good with y'all boys, man? It's your boy just hit up again with another video. And today, you feel me? Let's go out for work. It's worth me some overtime today, you feel me? Because I wasn't doing nothing else. And I figured, why not get a couple more hours in? So, yeah, I got off at 7. It's like 7, 7 tw um, 29 right now. I just go in my little nature spot. Just sit back, relax. Really just gather my thoughts, you know? And really see, figure out what I'm going to do next, you know? And just calculate everything, you know? But... How y'all doing today, man? How's y'all day going? Let me know in the comments. What's something that you did today for the first time? Let me know in the comments. I want I want to know that. Also, how y'all doing? Y'all are y'all doing anything productive today? Like, let me know. Like, don't be afraid to comment because I'll be reading y'all comments. I'll be wanting to comment back. You feel me? So, um, whew, yeah, bro. Basically, I really just been working today. Been focused on myself been focused on my growth been talking to a lot of my co-workers a lot like i really mess with my like my um my morning shift like, like every, even though like the people like even though it'd be like little arguments and stuff and little like disagreements and little, like little animosity i still mess with it you know I, I i just like the environment i like that even though i'm the youngest one i can still like communicate with them like ask like you know like talk to them and get their um, peace of mind even though like a lot of them probably think i'm stupid a lot of them think i'm probably just a regular 18 year old but I be catching them though. I be man, like, like t today for example, one of my coworkers is like, man, you got um, you moved out yet? You got, you got an apartment? I'm like, nah. But when I do, though, I ain't even gonna get an apartment. I'm gonna give me a fourplex or a triplex and rent out the other ones while I'm living. And, then, and when I said that, she was like, huh? oh word. But that just shows like people don't even think that. You know? Look at the bunny rat. Best gonna jump with the pocket close, yeah. All right, no one, but um, yeah, bro. Basically, let me just say this. I don't know what I wanted to say. I do want to say though that I want to. I want to say this as because like I'm taking. It, I'm kind of experiencing. I experience this right now. When people go to the internet with anything, with any issue, any problems, just let them start it and finish it in the internet. Like, you know, like, for example, like, um, a lot of y'all don't know, but, I mean, some of y'all might know, I don't know. Or if y'all seen old, uh, old Girl story, you'll know. Dang, look at all this. What the heck? Dog, look at this. I look, you want to go down here. I see a little house. I walk back, I ain't trying, I ain't trying to trespass. But this is just a new little trail, I like this. But, um... Yeah, but basically, old girl, my ex, her story, she was going off on me type, you know? Like, she, I don't know if she used my name exactly, but my friends, it was like, telling me, like, dog, are you, like, did you see old girl's story? Like, I was like, what the, like, I was like, huh? Like, first thing I was like, oh, no, what's she do? Because, <laughs> like, at this point, like, I feel like I know this person like the back of my hand. So, like, if you really about to just do all that, like, if you really about to bring this on the internet, I know how you're going to come. I know what you're going to do, how you're going to say it. And, like, when they was telling me what she was doing and saying, like, it was just, it just threw me off, you know? Because I'm like, dang, I thought I knew you better than that. I thought you was better than to do that, you know? Like, but I obviously was wrong. But I was also right, though, because that's why I ended things, you feel me? Because obviously we in two different mind spaces, you feel me? Two different time zones, I feel like, in, in our minds. And I just can't do that, you feel me? I can't pull myself down. I can't let myself fall short to what I'm capable of, you know? And I let that be known and I, and I vocalized it. I could have vocalized it better, but I vocalized it to the best of my ability at the time because, you know, I got life going on. I got to focus on me. And the last thing I want to worry about is confrontation when it comes to that because that'd be serious for me. But yeah, that's what it is. Let y'all know, man. Just because you ain't finna see you know, you ain't finna see her in our videos or my videos no more. Uh, Only fans out the window, unless like I make some like for myself, like it's gonna be my my own personal one. Cause that's that's another thing too. Like that's something I would do. Like I'm starting all this different stuff. Like, I'm putting the initiative out there. Like I'm doing all this stuff, and it was like really no help, you know. And usually like the type of relationship I want to be in, like I want it to be feel like a team instead of just a relationship. Cause we got we got to be a team. We got to be able to work together and not just 
be in a relationship together, if that makes sense. You know, like, I want to be productive every day. Like, especially when I'm at my life. Like, every time I wake up in the morning, I wake up 5 every morning. And I, I'm ready. I'm eager to, to see the new, um, like, the new opportunities, the new things I'm going to learn. Like, all that. Like, just take up, soak up everything. That's what I'm excited for when I wake up, you know? And that's why I want someone else to be with me. But that's how I want someone else to be with me, if they're with me. But... Yeah, your boy ain't looking for no one. I ain't even trying to get invested with nobody. I'm trying to invest in myself. But I ain't gonna lie. I just walked this little trail. I don't know what the I don't know what this trail is for, but I kinda like it. Like it's hard. I wonder what it, I wonder what they did it for. I see little train tracks and junk. Let me tell y'all, bro. Like But I just wanna let y'all know, man. If y'all going through a breakup, if y'all ever went through a breakup or y'all still dealing with a breakup, just just know like Instead of sitting there and just feeling sad and feeling bad, because I know how that like that feels, you know, like I've been in many breakups. I've been in a lot of like I felt a lot of them, like different feeling ones, like like they're all like it's, I feel like it's all in the mindset. If you if you literally trap yourself with sad music, dark room, darkness, blocking everything out, all good things, and you just sit in that thing, like in that, sit in that feeling, it's gonna be the worst thing ever. You're gonna feel all type of horrible thoughts. You know, instead of doing that, change your perspective. Get your mind off of it, you know? Be productive. Get, make yourself busy so you don't have to just sit there and think about what could, what should have, could have, would have happened, you know? Instead of that, make something happen. Make something happen for yourself. Like, and that's all I can really say from me. But, of course, I, I wish the best for her. I hope she has an amazing life. I hope she does good with herself and doesn't make any wrong decisions. Even though she might, you know, because we all human, we all make bad decisions. But I hope she doesn't make too bad of decisions that she can't um, get back out of. But just know, man, your boy is out here grinding, finding his purpose. Well, I already know my purpose, but finding deeper into digging deeper into my purpose. Um, yeah, man, just keep on staying productive. You feel me? Keep on doing what makes you happy. Keep on doing what makes you smile every morning. You know. Because that's, that's the real definition of success. I saw this on um, one of um, Gary V's posts on YouTube. It was like, success isn't a dollar amount. It's be, like it's waking up every morning and actually feeling good. Like genuinely good, you know? And I, I, I really felt when he said that because I feel like money, like, bro, like dog, money can come and go. Like money is always going to be here, you feel me? But you, you're not always going to be here. So you have to make sure you get that um that healthy like that healthy relationship that healthy bond with yourself before you're gone so it spreads you know money it's gonna come and go it's gonna spread regardless no matter who or what happens but with yourself you can you can have way more of an impact on someone than money can ever do you feel me money's too saturated but you in particular you're not us humans are not too saturated there's too there's so many different beings there's so many different species so many different all that you know so yeah just keep that in mind you feel me just wake up every morning planning on to make make it act, no wake up every morning wanting to genuinely feel good instead of just wanting to make money and that's what i'm gonna end this video off of i love y'all man take it easy um don't let no female or don't let no dude control your life don't make don't have them don't let them have control over your heart, over your emotions, over your feelings. And don't want, don't need nobody in a, in a relationship. I'm going to end it off like that. Don't need nobody in a relationship. Just if you, be with someone that you want to be with. Not that you need to be with. Need yourself at the most. But um, yeah, man, I love y'all. Take it easy.